Welcome back to Day Z. Today we are returning to the treacherous land of Deeral, where I'll be taking you on my journey, not only exploring the map, but more importantly, how I lived on an abandoned island for an entire week. Now this ended up being a massive challenge with lots of hurdles along the way, but with the help of others, by the end of the week, we transformed the island into an impenetrable fortress. But when I say this journey was a challenge, I mean it. But that's what makes this a good story. So let's take it from the very beginning as a freshborn at the coast. All right, we're in the server. I literally just joined the server, I'm a freshborn. There's another freshborn over there as well. Um, yeah, so we're on Dero and I'm trying to live on an island for a week. Uh, and uh, yeah, I'm not really sure how this is gonna go, but um, yeah, the plan is basically just, just to get as rich as possible Try and fortify the island as much as possible. Get as much loot as possible. And, uh... Yeah. That's kind of kind of the plan. This guy's got a knife out. He's going to attack me. But, yeah. Um, and I actually have an exact island in mind as well. It's, it's kind of down south. It's not too far up north. It's quite close to the spawn area. And, uh... Yeah, but we're not actually limited just to the island, obviously. If we were just living limited to the island, I mean, it would be impossible. There's nothing on the island. I mean, there's nothing on any of these real islands. So, we do have to venture inland and on the mainland of Deer Isle, but for the most part, it's just to basically get as geared as possible. That's, that's kind, of, kind of the plan. Hopefully do some raids, build up some... Uh, quite a lot of loot. Man, that was essentially my overall goal. But before I could do any of that, of course, I needed to find out if this island was even free to take over. So first things first, I went over to check it out. Okay. Right, we made it to the island. Before I start dying, let me just eat a bit of food. Okay, cool. Um, Yeah, this is the island I had in mind. Um, I just need to see all it's got. It's literally just one empty island, but all it's got is a lighthouse. And if this lighthouse is free for the taking, this means that we can move in. And we can occupy this island, but oh, it looks clear. Yeah, yeah, it's clear. No one's, no one's uh, taking this over. And this is, uh, this is kind of the beginning. I don't know what this is going to turn out to be, or what this is going to look like. But I wonder how this will all look by the end. And so the island was free for the taking. All that stood between me and claiming it for myself, of course, with the missing base supplies. But as it was turning nighttime, this was my opportunity to get further inland without running into other players. So over the next 20 minutes through the darkness of the night, I made my way towards Area 42. This place was my best chance to not only find the base supplies I needed, but hopefully some military loot. Ah, we made it. Is, uh, this is going to be pretty good, I think. Area 42 has got, got some decent loot. 556 mag, bro. Oh, new jacket. Take it. Okay, I'm kind of running out of space here, so I think I'm just going to leave here in a second. Uh, but I will loot a, I'm going to loot a tiny bit more before I go. Oh! <gasps> One more. I killed one. Oh my god. I'm gonna try and flank on this guy. If I flank into this HQ building, I might be able to kill this guy. There's at least one more. There could be two more. Okay, if I get in, I should get a view on this guy here. Oh, he's on me in here! Oh, he's dead! What's my HP? <gasps> Holy 
shit! Dude, I couldn't be lower right now. I couldn't be. Oh, dude, he has a lot as well. Nice. Oh, my leg is broken, so I'm going to need some uh, splinters on them. Okay, dude, I've got to just get out of here. Okay, there's a splint. Fixed fracture. Oh my god, man, that was that was really close. I got some good loot out of that, like some really good loot. But it was definitely a big win. But if I wanted to survive with all of it, I needed to get as far from that military base as possible. So I limped my way out of Area 42, and I headed in the west direction towards Waldeboro City to meet my good friend Edvin, who was actually already there looting for some more base supplies. I got metal wire. Edvin, where are you? Come on the main road. Call me Raggy. <laughs> hey, come here. Yeah, come on. Okay, come to the bushes. <laughs> Go towards the bushes. Get in my bushes. Hello! My Let's see what we're working with. So, we've got box of nails. One, two. We've got metal wire. We've got a hacksaw, hatchet. We have storage on the floor there. Two, you've got some more metal wire. Okay, so you've got... So what are we missing? All we need... And you've got a pickaxe as well, right? I do, on my on my back. Okay, so in that case, all we need right now... Just a code lock, yeah. Yeah, basically. We had virtually everything needed to build, except for a code lock. But right as we were checking up on the last few sheds, we had a stroke of luck. Hold on, you... you <gasps> Oh my god! Yo! Let's... It's been a setup all this time. <laughs> <laughs> now with a code lock in our inventory, we now had everything needed to build, and we could finally return to the island down south. So we did, but ran into a bit of trouble along the way. Oh! Oh! No, is it? Coming. I had a Winchester, nice. What? But eventually, we made it to the coast just off the island. Okay, Edvin, the island is over here. Right, that's the island. Oh, there's a. Wait, 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 wait. There's a guy swimming towards us from the. What? Is he swimming towards the island? You see that? There's a guy swimming. Yeah, I see him. He's swimming towards us. Nice no, going towards the island, bro. Is he? Yeah, he is still swimming. To Why do you think he's swimming to our island? No clue. And here we have a wild Roberto swimming for his prey. <laughs> oh, shoot. He's right here. He's friendly, I think. He is. Wait. Yo. What's up? Friendly? Hello, hello. Hello, my friend. Where are you? F What's your name? Hello, hello. Nice to meet you. Uh, I have like uh, installed the game five minutes ago, so mm. I'm new. What? So what's your name? Well, my name is uh, Hamil, and your name? My name is Roberto. Oh, that's also nice. Yeah. Well, we we're wondering why you come to this island, but this is actually where we're about to build a base. We're about to take over this island and live here. Um, oh. Oh. Okay. If you want my help, I, I can help you somehow. However, I have no I, 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 idea what to do. <laughs> well, we can work together if you want, man. I mean, are you going to be on tomorrow? Because we're about to get off for the night. But uh, we're going to be back on, on again tomorrow. If you're on, we can team up again at each other. Oh, okay. Sure. Nice. Nice. It would be a pleasure to work with you. Okay, cool. So, what should we call you, bro? Should we? What do we call you? What about Cami? Oh, sure, sure. Cami. Would be nice. Hi, right, bro. Nice to meet you. Okay, guys. So, have a nice uh, playing and see you uh, later. See you later, man. You, bye, bye. Take care, bro. See you, Cami.
Literally fucking 2,000 decades later. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> After making acquaintance with our new friend Kami, who we'd hopefully be seeing again soon, it was about time we started building and claimed this island for ourselves. This will be our home, Edwin. Okay, turning it into a gate, then I just need to add the code lock. Boom! Nice! And then... Right, bro, this is so cool. We actually secured this. So this is this is basically the beginning. This is fun, bro. We did, we've done well, to be fair. We haven't died yet and lost anything. <laughs> okay, cool. We're good. Yeah? Alright. Hell yeah, brother. GG's man. See you in the morning. Let's do it, bro. See ya. Alright. Another day. We haven't been raided, luckily. This is really good. This is all, uh, it's five of the night. I mean, not that we had too much, and I, to be fair, I did log out with all the spare guns, but I believe, is our friend in? Oh, he's down there. Is he in the bushes? No, he's not here, bro. <laughs> That's the thing. Wait, what? Oh. So he's not actually here. Interesting. You will, will be missed, Cammy. All right, well, um... I guess uh, what's the plan? I guess we're gonna we we want we want to get some nails. Yeah. We want to get as many nails as possible. A few more guns, ideally a bit more storage. Let's do it. Let's go. Okay, so the plan is to head inland. We're gonna see if we can build up a bit more, a few more guns, a few more, a few more building supplies, maybe a bit of storage. There's a lot we need. We just need everything at the moment. But um, but yeah, let's do this. Although we'd secured the island, our base was still very easy to raid. In fact, I think if any clan came across it, they would be able to raid it in an instant. So me and Edvin made our way inland on the mainland to see what base supplies we could find, and also some military gear if the opportunity presented itself. Oh, oh, you hear this? That has to be Camp Eagle, bro. Oh, I see him, I see him, I see him. Where? He has to be in one of the barracks, the L-shaped barrack. If we get on top of the... Tech building there, we could get an angle. Yeah. One dead. Good shot, good shot, good shot. Thank you. Okay, let's see what he's got. Yeah, SKS here with the PU scope, AKU. Okay, let's uh, get out of there. We then headed further north from town to town in pursuit of base supplies. Oh, I found that hacksaw. Box of nails! Wait, really? Box of nails! Hard one. Nice. Oh, shoot! Someone's been up to something. Oh, box of nails. Nice. We continued searching each town until our backpacks were completely full. And as nighttime was closing in, we started heading back to the island. But on our way, something caught Edvin's eye. Oh, Josh, Josh, left, what? left side, left side, lights. Is it moving around? Yes. Oh, yeah, there's zombies. Zombies. It's a guy in there, I think. Yeah, it's a guy inside. Okay, yeah, yeah, we can go talk to him if you want. There's two of them. There's two of them. They're not that good. You guys friendly? Hello? Where are you? Right here. You friendly, bro? Oh, mate. Hello. Oh, there he is. Look. Hello, what are you mate. Saying? So, what are you uh, what are you guys to? doing at the moment? Well, I'm just roaming around. Our curiosity led us to encounter a couple of players looting near our island. And although they seemed friendly, we had too many base supplies on us to lose. So we got ready to bounce. But just as we were ready to leave, someone appeared that made this whole encounter worthwhile. Guys, guys, hello. 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 You want? I'm friendly. I'm friendly, okay? Right here, bro. Who are you? Are you friendly? I'm friendly. I oh shit, mate! Put it away. Oh, Put the gun away. <laughs> Put it away, or I'll kill you. Sorry, fuck me, mate. That's good karma. Holy shit! <laughs> How you doing? I'm good. I'm good, man. Hey, yeah, yeah. Hey, how you guys doing? Oh, damn. Down. 
it's a big company. You guys could sort of just let us pass through then. Make this a friendly encounter. Yeah, go for it, man. If, what's your name in game? Uh, I'll type hi, I'm Tillman. Hi. Tillman, okay. And then you guys? We're the yeah. Bimbo Baggins, okay. Pop. I'm Matty. Matty, okay. The pull out brothers, because our pull out game is weak. <laughs> right, guys, well, listen, if you guys find any nails, okay, we'll trade you a lot of, a lot of, well, whatever you need, because we've got a lot of stuff, but we just need a load of nails. Uh, I think there should be nails. Um, we died here before. Yeah. I know where nails nails are if you come with me. Okay, yeah, Should that's fine. Like 30 left. We'll we'll give you some good loot in exchange. Perfect. Okay, they seem friendly. That's 40 nails, sound. 40 nails. Yeah, there you go. Just for letting us live. If you want to give, it, give us something, <laughs> yeah, would be nice. Thank you, bro. Well, what do you need? Do you have any gun or something, like, more high caliber than an MK2 you could give up? There's a uh, Winchester there. You need oh, to repair yeah, it, but that's yeah. pretty good. Alright guys, well look, if you find any more nails, okay, or if you want to team up maybe, you know, and join us, then you're also free, but we're going to be, uh, I mean, if you want more information, just, just ask for Roberto in the chat and we can meet up, but other than that, good luck. Yeah, yeah. Until then, Thank good luck, yeah. Thanks. Cheers. Bye. Bye. See ya, boys. See ya. Perfect. There you guys. Bye guys. Pleasure. I mean, what do you think of these guys? Do we team up with them? I mean, uh, they seem friendly, yeah. After that encounter, me and Edvin made our way back to the island to secure our base supplies and hopefully fortify our base further. But there was something about that encounter with those guys. You see, sometimes on this game, a single interaction with someone that could have very easily been missed can take you on a completely different journey. And there was something about Tillman and Bimbo that felt like it should have been much more than just a small trade for some nails. Regardless, they were gone and we'd now arrived back at the island. So after depoting our important valuables, we started preparing to expand our starter base. But just as we started building, we got a message. Wanna team up with the Medvin? What do you think? Hell yeah, man. They seem nice. And the rest was history. After finishing up building, we told them where our island was located, and they came over. Hello! Welcome to the island! <laughs> Very Hello. nice place you got Hello. Hello. here. Hello. So basically, uh, yeah, I'll go with this a goal ultimately is just to live on an island, see how much success we can get on an island, how much loot we can get, and just see what happens really. But I mean, I, th I kind of, I kind of want to grow this into a bit more than just us, and maybe into like a some sort of civilization, living away from mainland, you know, and we uh, just go to a big group. Sounds like a good plan. The island, island boys. boys. <laughs> <laughs> um. So yeah, you guys want to? Do, do you guys want to uh, want to join? Yes, I'll Yeah, so. we'd love to. Right, well, at the moment, what we need mostly is base building supplies, base building storage. Uh, we need as many guns, ammo, vests as possible. And if you see any people, you know, and they seem friendly, then I guess recruit as well. Let's go. Okay, sounds like a plan. Yeah. And with that said, we headed off to do our biggest loot run yet. But before we headed far, far north, there was another friend of mine called Tommy who wanted to help us along the way. Tommy boy! Hey! Hey yo! Oh, God! Oh, Let's go! And as one big group, we set off. Okay, so, uh, guys. We've got a bit more loot now, okay, we're, uh, we're, we're we're doing a bit better now than we were earlier. I'm just not really sure where to loot next. Uh, I kind of feel like we should go for some PvP though, because we've definitely got the guns for it now. Mm. Our best bet's airfield for PvP and loot. Okay, well, we can go there then, we can make our way down that way. It's, it's been hella quiet for the last half an hour. It has, too quiet. Over the past hour, while looting our way up north, 
We didn't see anyone. Now that we were armed with better weapons, we wanted to put those weapons to the test by PvPing at the airfield. But fate had other plans, as en route we stumbled upon something far beyond the PvP we were looking for. Ooh! Gunshot ahead, gunfight ahead. No, that's dead ahead. Guys, do you, uh, are, you empty? are your bags empty? Not empty, but I've got some space. Okay, okay, so I'd stash your bags of anything important before we go into this gunfight and then mark it. I'm gonna put my bag here full of good loot right there. You guys have got any nails, available building supplies, if you can put them away in this before we go into this fight, because uh, could in case it goes south. There we go, bro. You guys ready to push over to this? Because this is a massive fight, I think. Yeah, it is, man. We can't miss this out, bro. Right ahead of us. Right ahead of us. This isn't even in a town, dude. What is happening over here? Is it a raid? Okay, I'm pretty close here, dude. I have no idea where they are. Oh, I see one. I see one. We have one here. One's uh, on my tee. On your tee? Copy. Miss, miss, miss. One more close. One more close there. Close there. He's dead. Good kill. One dead, one dead. One more, one more. He's in a tree line still, right? LAR shit! Watch out guys, watch out! They got big guns! I don't see him, bro. Try and flank if you can. We have a base here. Yeah, that they might be raiding, I think. Oh no, one he's you hear that shot? Do you hear that shot? Yeah, I hear them. He's dead, he's dead, he's dead, he's dead. One dead, one dead. I'm low though, I'm low. On my... Uh, oh, no. Run, 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 Edwin. Run, run, run. I'm dead. You died? Yeah, I'm dead. Yo, hello. Hey, just help me get here now quickly. Huge gunfight. I killed two. Yeah, come on. One's dead, full dead. He's got an LAR. He's geared. Yo, you good, bro? You low? One on come, one more on come. One more low here on me. He's inside. You. What? No, I'm dead, bro. Shit. Hit both blaze shots. What? Killed one, killed one, mate. Nice. I'm hit. I'm not out. Oh. Come on, Tommy. You got this, man. Come on. Yeah, I need you to hold, mate. I need you to hold. Yeah, hold it. Just hold this building, mate, please. With all of us dead, except for just Tommy and Bimbo, who were on the brink of death, this was almost over. It felt like we'd killed so many of these guys, but more and more of them were coming back, making this an unwinnable battle. Nevertheless, we made our way back ourselves, but Bimbo was in trouble. Oh, he's getting shot at, he's getting shot at. He's dead. No. And with Bimbo dead as well, we'd almost completely lost this. But through the darkness of the night, I was able to regroup with Tommy and get a kit back. But more and more enemy players started to show up. Oh, are you good? Log cabin up the hill. I, I see one, I see one. Hit one, hit, hit once, hit once. He might be dead. Oh no, I'm hit, I'm hit. Another, another, another. Okay. He's dead. He's dead, he's dead, he's dead. I'm dead, I'm dead. Don't even know where that was from. I've killed one though. Oh, guy on the road here, guy on the road here, geared. No. Run, 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 run. I've hit them, there's two more. Players upon players showing up. This gunfight felt like it was never ending. Although I did manage to kill a couple of players, it was eventually down to just me alive, and I was overwhelmed. And it was over. We just had to accept this massive L and call it quits. But I couldn't log off without grabbing our stash from earlier. So once I grabbed that, I logged off.
back in the server for another day. I mean, that was a kind of unfortunate loss yesterday. We did lose a lot of our guns because there were so many of these guys. But it's all good. The server pop's kind of low now. We got on a bit earlier than most people are getting on. So uh, we're going to do a bit of a loot room real quick. And I'm just going to, before that, I'm just going to stash away these two bags. There we go. Now, but after that huge loss yesterday, it's fair to say our team morale was down pretty bad. And to make things worse, we were now down to our very last weapons. Which is why today, it was very important to win back some loot. While the server pop was low, this was our chance to gather as much high tier loot before the server filled up. And I knew the best place to do just that. And it was of course, at the temple. Now, for those of you who don't know, this temple spawns some of the highest tier loot on the server. And for that very reason, it's usually extremely hard to access. But if the server pop is low enough, there's a good chance you can sneak in through the portal to get there. And me and Tommy were willing to take that chance. So once we met up, we headed over to the portal. Right, this is our opportunity to go into this ten temple. Unfortunately, the other guys aren't on yet, but me and Tommy can go and see if we can loot a bit. And uh, then we can be joined by the others. Hey, Tommy, come here. Gotta cut each other. There we go, you slice me. Bleed him? Yeah, yeah, I'm bleeding. Let's go, let's go, let's go. Oh, I'm in, I'm in. Oh, dude, we made it. Oh my god, this is so scary. What's this in? Oh, M4, bro. Really? Yeah, this is going to be some good loot here, man. I can already tell. Oh, bro. Oh, LAR. Let's no go. Way. It's worth it. Oh, really, bro? Really? Yeah, LAR. Yes, man. found another LAR, man. I know it might seem like we sped through this place, but we definitely didn't. This place was absolutely massive, and we ended up staying here for a full day cycle, looting all corners, every secret loot room, and cave, until me and Tommy had absolutely no space left. And it was time to get the hell out of there. This was the win we were looking for. Okay. Ooh, I'm running, I'm running. Oh my god. Ooh. That was crazy, man. Oh my god, Josh. Finally, back to the island. Alright, we made it to the island. Let's go. Just gotta deep all these nails and stuff. We'd done it. We'd safely returned to our island with all of the high tier loot we'd found at the temple and all of the base supplies that we'd stashed from yesterday. This was a massive redemption after the huge L we took yesterday and we were now back on track. But we didn't want to stop there. Instead of logging off, we wanted to go out on one PvP run. So once Edvin had logged on, the three of us headed back to mainland to try and win some more loot. Except this time... We couldn't lose. Oh. Let's catch shots that way. Did you hear that? Yeah. Yeah, oh. I hear it. It's really, really close. What the hell are they shooting at over here? There's nothing over There's here. There's nothing over here. It's a coastal line. Are they shooting at the ocean? Doing out the fish, obviously, man. They're fishing. Two guys on that bridge right there. What? Really? Kid? Yes. Yeah, yeah. Really good. I don't see Three gears, three guys, four guys, one over there as well. <laughs> four guys. Wait, are they close, guys? Are they close? Are they close? Comes, yeah, close behind the house, mate. Okay, 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 okay. But are they behind the house or what? I, I think they moved from there, mate. I think they've covered them through the bushes. Where could they have moved? I think they've gone into the trees, mate. Oh! Ah! Edvin, run, Edvin, run! One on me. 
I'm, I'm hit. I'm hit. I need help. One dead. One dead. One full dead. I've killed one. I've killed one. I need help though, Josh. I've killed one as well. I'm coming. I'm coming. I've, I've run out of bullets in the mag. Back off. Back off, back off. Me too. Me too. Me too. I've backed off. I've backed off. I've backed off. I've got to finish one. I've got to finish one. I finished him. Great, mate. Good. Uh, I see a dead guy here. Yeah, that's the one I killed. Uh, look. Oh. oh, I'm dead. Bro, he's in the bushes he's, there, he's Josh. He's protecting that body, bro. He's protecting that body. Dead on me. One dead on me. On me. I'm, guns jammed on me. On me, Josh. He's coming. One con. Nice, nice, nice. That's the guy I saw on the other island. Full dead. He's full dead now. Yeah, he had a Winchester here. This has got to be the guy. Yeah, the guy over here, Josh, has got an SK, but he's, he's fucking stacked, Let me see, mate. let me see, let me see. I want to see. He's stacked. Oh, shoot, Winchester he's, as well, dude. He's I'm stacked. Gonna... Oh, holy shit. We just got to loot these other guys now and then dip. Hmm? <laughs> what? What'd you get? What's a mag? I'm checking. I'm looting. I'm looking. I'm looting. I'm looting. And this guy, he's got four. He's got Thor's hammer. Thor's hammer? Are you serious? Come here, Josh. The one I'm Seriously, bro. Come to okay. <laughs> Hold on. Come shush, to the one I'm shush, 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 shush. I need you to come to the one I killed. <laughs> LAR. <laughs> Holy shit. Bro, grab it all. We need to. Okay, we need to move. We need to move. We need to move. We need to start moving, Lou. I wonder why they had Thor's hammer. Oh, they must have just left, dude. They might have just left the... Um... Yeah, that's why they're so stacked. They had Lars on them and shit. Yeah, the temple. The temple, because it's near here. I want to I wanna move hit, out hit, of here, though. The guy on me. Good fucking shot, Josh. Oh. Guy up the hill. Oh, he's hit me. He's hit no. me. I see him though. He's in the tree. Guys, we have to just run. We have to run. Come to me and we've got to run. Run, boys. GG, bro. Oh my god, that's big. Although we gained ourselves some distance, it wasn't over just yet. Oh shit. Oh, we're taking fire, bro. There's Fuck, two people. There's two bro. of them as well. Getting shot off. I'm shooting back, I'm shooting back. I'm hit, I'm hit, I'm hit, I'm hit. Bro, you have to just keep some in. Zigzag if you can. Okay. They're really, really good at getting close. Run, 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 run. Okay, let's go, yeah, let's go. Do you think that's them? Yeah, yeah, they were. I, was like, I saw them. Oh my god, they're mad. I think we pissed off the wrong group right there, man. Unlucky boys. <laughs> Thankfully, we were able to make it back to the island with everything, and it was huge. Because of the amount of high-tier loot these guys had, including the rare Thor's hammer, we figured they must have just left the temple that we were at earlier. And with some lucky timing, we'd caught them right as they were leaving. And we escaped with everything. After the L we took yesterday, this was exactly what we needed to boost our morale. Once we depoted everything away on our base, we took a well-deserved break. And that break went on for a little longer than I expected. So we continue our story the next day. <gasps> Let's go! Not raided! Another day. We live to see another day, man. Let's go, dude. Okay, so I think the plan today is to try and try and get as many nails as possible because I really want to expand this island because we're very lucky we've survived this long. But uh, if we really want to continue surviving throughout the week, we're going we're gonna to need to expand this base. And, and uh, you can raid through gates and walls, so it's not like we can just do like layers upon layers here going out here there's no point because they could just raid through this thing right here so uh the only thing we can do next is to kind of just fortify and make a big compound around this that's kind of the goal but we're gonna need a lot of nails i mean we might need like over a thousand nails to really do that we've only got like maybe a couple of hundred at the moment and that was pretty much our goal for the day but if we wanted to turn this little island base into a fort then we were going to need a lot of nails and also barbed wire 
so I did a stock count in our base to see how much we already had. Edvin, I know there was barbed wire right there. Where'd it go? I have no clue, man. No clue at all. Oh my god, dude. <laughs> Let me see it. I mean, look, look, look at it, bro. It's literally Lucille. It even has no exceptions from day C on it. Now I can literally run around. Little pig, little pig. Alright, well, there's one barbed wire gone. <laughs> <laughs> Thanks to Edvin, we were already one barbed wire down, and we had nowhere near enough nails anyway. So, me and Edvin headed to mainland to do our biggest base supply run yet. But on our way, something caught my attention. Look at this base. What do you think's in there? Oh, probably base stuff. This could be good. Okay, should we mark this? Because we could raid this. We could, yeah. After noting down a base to potentially raid later, we made our way further north, where we actually managed to kill a guy who provided our first boxes of nails. Two boxes of nails! Nice! Nice! And a Mosin, that's actually decent. After that lucky kill, we headed even further north to meet up with Tommy, and our luck didn't stop there. I have box of nails. No way. Yeah. Box of nails. Nice. Player, player, right in front of you guys. Either tree. Uh, I don't uh, know. Oh, I see, coming towards us, coming towards us. Hit once, uncon, uncon. Hit a play care and everything. Good call out, Edwin. Oh, box of nails. Nice. Ah! Getting shot. Got him, I got him. Nice. Oh, wow. Hit a lot, hit a lot. Box of nails. Oh, another box of nails! Nails! Another box of nails! Oh my god! We now had more than enough nails to expand our island base. So it was time now to make the long journey back. Um, Edvin? Yeah? Look out on the field. Mm. Little pig, little pig! Let me... No! <laughs> Eventually, we made it back to the island in one piece. And the island expansion could begin. That's so good, man. Look at all those nails. Okay, so... I guess i got to start gathering logs. So it begins. We cut down every available tree on our island until there were none left. Then the server restarted, and when we joined back, Tillman was there. Hey yo. <laughs> I'm good, bro. Do you mind if I help you guys build? I mean, it's safe if you'd rather do it on your own. Nah, if you want to, but we just ha we just need help moving logs. <laughs> yep, come. I'll grab as many as possible. Thank you, bro. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> Compounds are looking pretty good at the moment. This is really good. Wow. They're off to get some more plants as well. But this is going so well, man. I love it. We'd finished building the first stage of our compound, but it took a little longer than we expected, so we called it for the day and agreed to continue building the next day. We're in. Are we raided? I don't think we are. Oh, dude, they added a bunch of planks as well to this. Let's go. Okay, so we're just going to continue on building, finishing this compound. I think, that, yeah, luckily Tillman and his friend managed to get a bunch of planks to each of these fences. So we might be able to finish this. All right, let's go. We continue our story the next day, of course, where I decided to join the server earlier in the day to continue building our compound. 
But that day, I was determined to finish this island base. So I built wall upon wall upon wall, which somehow caught the attention of a player on the mainland. Whoa! What's up? It turns out this guy had spotted me building from mainland, and he even wanted to help me. So together, we continued building the island compound. First bit of the uh, compound's now done. Let's see what it looks from up here. This is this is so cool. We've got farming going on there. We're gonna slowly build up these watchtowers now. That's the next goal. Get barbed wire to go all the way around. This is exciting. We were getting closer and closer to finishing this island, but we were running a bit low on base supplies. And at this point, we were sick of doing loot runs, so we decided to raid the base that we'd seen yesterday, hoping to get what we needed from that. But sadly, they had barely any base supplies, and there were way too many gates to get to their core cool loot. So we cut our losses and headed back to the island. Guy up in the air above us! Right there. Okay, once. Dead, dead, dead. And once we finally returned to the island, we found not just one, but two more people that wanted to join us. And as one big group sharing the island, we made the final stretch to finish this base. Let's go, man. It's done. By day six, we had reached what you'd call the pinnacle. We'd completed our full base and officially conquered this island. We set up a self-sustained farm, providing us with more than enough food. We had unlimited food from the ocean, and we had enough weapons and ammo to defend any intruders attacking the island. And following our fight on day three, where we stole Thor's hammer, we were able to fully explore the Arctic temple, getting ourselves some of the highest tier loot on the server. Oh my god. Well, other than that, not much really happened. You see, the reality of living on an island so isolated from mainland is it's actually kind of lonely. There was a point we'd reached where we didn't even have to leave the island anymore. And our days were mostly spent, well, doing nothing. Okay, well, um, it's another day on the server. Uh, yeah, we've, I mean, this, this marks a, a week it's been on the server, um, it's, uh, we've expanded our group, we've got loads of storage, we've managed to get all the guns away here, we, I mean, we've got loads of grenades, explosives, loads of ammo, um, we've managed to fully build our, our, our compound here with watchtowers, we aren't, we're not able to fully build the watchtowers because we don't have sheet metal, Got our flag here. We've managed to get two tents as well. I mean, yeah, I'm not really sure what there is to do at the moment. Um, we've, we've kind of done everything we wanted to do on the server. Um, farming, fishing, everything. We, we've kind of done everything <laughs> I wanted to achieve. There's not much left to do on this server. Yo, Hosh, what's the plan? I don't really know, man. No doubt, this has been a fun, fun ride. Well, I think it was time to move on to other adventures and say goodbye to this island.
Okay, um, I just loaded into the server. Tillman and uh, the other guys are actually online now. Okay, let's let's talk to these guys. Hello, boys. Hello. Hey, hey. How's it going? What's up? Um, we've like done it. I've basically done everything I want to do on this server and with this island. There's only so much I could have done, and I'm actually pretty happy with the help of you guys. Like we were able to get get a lot done, but uh, there's yeah. I mean, there's not really much much else for me really left on the server. But if you guys want to keep playing and continue on the legacy, you know. Yeah, we'd love that. Yeah, it's yours for the keeping because I'm gonna I'm gonna just call it here. To be honest, well, yeah, like I said, we've done everything we want to do. Thank you. Thank very you. Much. Thank you. Have a good one. Maybe we'll play again in the future. Who knows? You know. But I've got you guys on uh, on Discord and stuff, so it, you know. Yeah, if you need some some noobs to help you out, <laughs> just call us. And you've taught us to be friendly a few more times. Yes, bro, yeah. There is, f There are friendly people. But yeah, no, thanks for being cool, guys, honestly. Um, and yeah, enjoy it. Enjoy the island. Have fun with the loot. Just Yeah, thank you too, man. It was a pleasure. For sure. All right, guys. Bye, island boys. Goodbye. All right. Well, that's it, really. I mean, I don't know, man. I think, like I said, I I've done everything I want to do on the server, so I'm going to call it. Um, but this was fun, man. This, like, we did really well. I mean, meeting these guys as well, that was a big part of the success as well. But that was really good. I'm really happy with that. Goodbye, island.